Hi everybody, thank you for tuning in to Tekra's YouTube channel. Today I wanted to show you how to lay out and print a graphic for a button in Cricut Design Space software. Those of you that do buttons already probably know that either Corel or Adobe or a program like that are best for laying out graphics, but I wanted to see if it was possible in Design Space and it turns out it is. So let's take a look at that. You will need a, your cut line in the image area for the button that you're gonna be making. And you can get these right on Tekra.com by clicking on Button Maker Resources at the top and then selecting Instructions and Layouts and scrolling down to the size you need. For the purpose of this demonstration, we're going to be doing the two and a quarter size. And it will give you the cut line and then the picture size. Remembering that some of your print is actually going to wrap around the button and be crimped into the back. Now I took those two measurements and I just wrote them on the side to help me. And then I created this guide. This guide is the image area. And this will help ensure that my image is actually going to be seen on the front of the button. And it'll also help me with centering my image on the button. And the way I created this little guide is I went over here to shapes. I chose the circle. And then I entered those measurements or that measurement 2.063 as my image area. I entered that up here to size it correctly. And then I went to operation and you can click on score and that'll give you this dashed line that you can use as um, a guide now. But first I want to create my button. So I'm going to select circle. I'm going to enter those cut lines, 2.625. Now I can change the color of this circle. And now I am ready to add that image. You'll want to click on the operation type and choose print, then cut. And we're never going to actually get to that cutting stage. We're just looking at printing a graphic for our buttons. Now I can scroll for an image. Um, looking for something to fit my food theme I have going on. Maybe I'll search for food. Here we go. We'll take this pretzel here. And now I'll just need to size this pretzel down. And this is where this guide will come in handy now. I can make sure that pretzel is actually going to be seen on the front of my button. You may have to arrange it and send it forward. And it looks like it fits in there. And I can also use it to make sure it is centered. And it looks good. At this point, you can add some text if you would like um, or anything else to your button. And you want, before we print this, we'll want to select it all. And then in the lower right hand corner, you need to click on flatten. That's an important step. And now we are ready to print our graphics. You can click on make it in the upper right hand corner. And this will show you an example or a template of what your print will look like. Now when you go to print it and you click on send a printer, if it gives you the option to fit to page or print actual size, you want to click on print actual size. If you click on fit to page, that can actually change some of the dimensions we entered in and it won't be the right size. And that's all you need to do. And that's how you create a button in Design Space software. I hope this helped. Thank you.